going on boys and girls ladies and gentlemen the ACMJ Gamer here today is all about Assassin's Creed Syndicate world premiere just came out today I do believe um, I wanted to let you guys know those of you who actually watch my channel um, uh, there are two editions that they are currently offering uh, for both or for Xbox one ps4 and PC um, basically you have gold edition which is 90 bucks you have the uh, regular edition which is 60. Um, and then there is a collector's edition, but it's not listed on here. I wanted to go through the gold edition real quick, what comes with it. If you pre-order, I think, any of the games, it comes with that necklace um, as a pre-order bonus. That's the necklace. Um, you get this little uh, mission. Um, you receive 10,000 bonus credits. Now, why you might want the season pass? Well, they haven't exactly clarified what that's going to be. It's just been um, exclusive content, I think, or digital content that'll expand it, I suppose. Um, but that's basically the difference uh, between the two. For those of you who, who don't understand, it's just gold edition is 90 bucks because it gets you the season pass. And then the standard edition is just 60 bucks without the pass, just the regular game. Now also, um, Ubisoft is milking their fans for money this time around because they have added another um, another collectible you can get. This is the uh, cane sword that is exclusive to this time era, I, I suppose. Um, it's a life-size replica of Jacob's signature weapon, um, fully detailed sword, and button-triggered spring-loaded scythe blade. Um, intricately sculpted plastic cane sword is 36 inches tall. So this is also 60 bucks, or yeah, 60 bucks, um, which I think is uh, is a fair price, but I mean, you know, there's one problem. They also have the hidden blade as well. Now, for those of you who don't know, I own the collector's ed editions of, I think, just AC4. I think everything else I bought DLC for, but I mainly own, yeah, it was AC4. Um, collector's edition for AC4. Um, I have the hidden blade for AC4. I have the hidden blade for Brotherhood. And two, they didn't do anything with. They just did the statue. I'm pretty sure. So basically, I haven't ordered anything since AC4, which means I skipped Unity. The only thing Unity offered was the crossbow hidden blade, I do believe. Um, and, and I mean, the, these hidden blades aren't really uh, that exclusive, I don't think. You can still buy, like, Assassin's Creed 4 or Assassin's Creed Brotherhood from Amazon for, like, 25 bucks. Um, so... These, I think, are, are getting, uh, I think, I personally would rather have, considering the price, like, if, if, if you are tight on money, and you want, say, the season pass in one of these, and you could only choose one between this and the, between this and the cane, I would definitely get the sword cane, because it looks a lot more, uh, badass, I guess, it looks a lot more like that, um, it also, it also, it's, it's more of a cosplay thing than this is, I get, well, I mean, they're both, they're both cosplay, but, you know, they, they've been doing Hidden Blades for the past four games, I think, and the only thing with this one, I think, is that it's just the Hidden Blade, and it's, the only difference is the, the design of it, really, um, they're, in the trailer, I do believe, which I'll be doing a video on later, in the trailer, um, it shows him doing the little, using the Hidden Blade gauntlet thing, I guess, um, that he uses to, like, climb up on rooftops and stuff. So I, I thought that was a pretty cool idea um, that they threw in there, but they don't have that on this. It's just the blade itself, I'm pretty sure, unless... Um, my size replicas functional hidden blade displays part. So retractable blade with switch style action locking mechanism, glove not included. Um, yeah, so I I don't think they have the thing that like pops up. So it's just the blade. So if I were, if anyone I think were to get one, I would I would rather get the the cane sword, um, definitely. Now, uh, as I mentioned before, there is a collector's edition. However, it is not listed on GameStop officially yet. And um, it also 
uh, does not have a listed price, I don't believe. So we're going to go to Google, and this is what I found when I searched up Assassin's Creed Syndicate Collector's Edition. So this Collector's Edition, obviously, um, there's no listed price. I'm sure that will change um, eventually. I know this one, this is a Ubisoft exclusive only on Uplay, which is Computer Edition. The only difference, really, I think, is the flask and this, whatever this is, and the statue is a little bit different. Other than that, I don't really think it's... Oh, different, but this is the edition that most people will be looking forward to. This is basically just your uh, typical standard um, Assassin's Creed set. You have the art book here, you have the official soundtrack, you have a statue of some sort, you have the London map or whatever, um, and then you have a box. Now something new that Ubisoft is doing this year um, is um, they're including the season pass in the collector's edition which is something they haven't done before. I think if Ubisoft really, 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 really wanted to make enough money off of it, they started putting whatever cosplay with the Collector's Edition. Like, say, say um, I think AC4 is like 150 So let's say if they price this Collector's Edition at... They'll probably place this one at 150 as well just because of the content that's in there. If they place this at say 225, 250 and they included um the cane sword and the hidden blade cosplay replica re replica, a lot of people would be over that like a lot of people would want to buy that because it has collector's edition, has season pass and it has the two um it has the two uh cosplay items, which I think are really cool. Um, so, I'm gonna see what, what, um, what, depending on this price, um, if, if I, de depending on this price, if this price is, like, ridiculous, like, if it's actually $250, probably not gonna buy it, probably just buy the, uh, $90 edition, which is the gold edition with one of the two cosplay things uh, probably the cane sword um if if i can get this i'll get this in the case hopefully it just depends on money and when i'll have to be saving up um and other news um the division has been delayed to next year 2016 um i think after rainbow six siege comes out um it'll be uh i think it come uh i think um the division will come out after rainbow six siege next year i think the division is scheduled to come out that march of next year but this i think is coming out in october i think i'm pretty sure it comes out in october i think the release date on gamestop was like 10 1 15 something but uh there's no listed price if there is a listed price i will get back to you guys on this i'll update you guys when i have if i have pre-ordered anything when or how, um, it just depends. But uh, that's it for now. I will be have I will have an update video or a video up probably later today as or tomorrow as well, um, doing an analysis of the debut trailer and everything that we see or do. So yeah, I'll give an update on when I pre-order stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.